Hey, 920, it is Jean and Bromley, and this was our Lindy 3 class. We were working on different rhythms and want to break down how Lindy Hop is really a two count dance and we can mix and match at any time that we want. So we had a little bit of a drill. We started with some rock steps. So we had rock step, This rock would be a four step, count. One, one, two, three, four. four. One, really two, using the floor three, and pushing. Four, one, two, then we made this six count one, and drifted two, three, forward a, four, a little bit. Five, back. A six, so one. Two, three, three, a four, four and five, five, a six. And then we made an eight count. Three, a four, step, weight change, step, weight change, triple, triple in. One, two, triple, step, step, triple, step. <clears throat> so after that, we put a four, six, and then eight, and kind of did it in a pattern. So I had one, two, three, four, one, two, three, one, two, three, a four, five, a six, one. These are our circles. Boom, boom, ha. Five, six, seven, and a one, two, three, five, six, seven, and a And you guys did a really good job mixing and matching it and really leading. Um, one thing we talked about on um, the four count one is that I stayed a little bit closer. Step, step, rock, step, step, step. And when I did the six count version, rock, one, step, two, I let my arm slide out a little three, bit. Three, a four. Step, and then I brought Jean back to me. Five, five a six. six. Or from this angle here, you'll see my right arm slide across Jean's back. One, Rock, step, two, three, four. Step. Now it's on the left side of Jean and right back into that pocket. Yeah. So um, we, we just wanted to get across how you can use your footwork. So if you want something to be a little bit snappier, a little quicker, you take out those triple steps. If you want to travel a little bit more, you use triple steps. If you really want to elongate it and be able to take up more space and take up more time, then you add triples and step steps. And it, again, it's all like two count rhythms that you can just put together um, in different sequences. Yep. From there, we uh, worked on a couple rhythms. We had our Shorty George with a kickball change. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right. And then we added a little. Um, I guess a uh, break step to get out of it. So I'd have three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and one, two. Um, one other rhythm that we did, we played with uh, some hops here. So we had step up, step up, kind of so like this is our light one. a little bit or, or lofting. And we had a different tone with that, just making it a more of a chug like in tap. So we had do, do pop, pop, do pop. So our, our loud, uh, not nighttime step. <laughs> Which so, we didn't incorporate that one yet, but we did include the Shorty George yeah. for the leaders. So what we worked on is uh, really uh, drifting our swing out. So I could follow Jean here and not let her go out the fire escape. <laughs> and with that idea, I could add that Shorty George step. Step, ba, ba, dee, ha, And follow, you could just ha, walk it out. Da, rock, step, triple. Triple, or you can or the do other way. apple jacks. Ba di di da di ha. Boop. Ba di ya da di da da di ha da da di da. Boop. Ha da da di. And that was our class, and we'll uh, continue from there next week.